It's a great day, five minute meditators. I hope that you are rising up from a beautiful night's rest, that you are giving yourself permission to have gratitude, grace, and thanksgiving, that you're being excited or getting excited about this harvest time, this switching of the season, learning to store your harvest, not trying to be greedy and use it all at one time, but really honoring yourself through storage with making sure that you're ready for the long haul without trying to run through everything real quick, right? When you're in harvest time, you're not looking at storing the right now. You're going to pick off of it. You're going to eat. You're going to supplement your needs. But you're going to make sure there's more and more seeds for the ground. So ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I give myself permission to store. I give myself permission to store. One of the things that happens in our life is we're running to and fro, multitasking, all this good stuff, and we forget to store up some of that harvest for ourselves. In fact, we become so content in the run that we forget to see ourselves. We forget to honor ourselves. You have a right to store and honor you. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I see my storage and I move in the direction of filling. I see my storage, and I move in the direction of filling. You want to make sure that you're filling you up. Be very cautious about going out in empty spaces and being empty. That makes you a little bit vulnerable. It makes you a little bit desperate, right? And when I say desperate, I'm saying like desperate for attention, yearning for attention because you're not filled, you're not full. That feeling is you loving you enough to store up what you need so that you can have it. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I honor me by recognizing my harvest and storing what I need. I honor me by recognizing my harvest and storing what I need. When you identify, and sometimes, you know, in a garden, the signs that you have may get blown down or pushed away or something of that nature, you have to wait for their seed to come up. But when it does, when the fruits of your labor come up, be ready to store a portion of that. Be ready to put it aside so that it can honor you later as needed. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I honor my presence in my harvest. I honor my presence in my harvest. A lot of times we can see the good that we do, but we don't often honor where we are. Honor being present, honor being available, honor being aware of who you are. When you have that, you're not looking for the white horse perspective of somebody coming in and being that hero. 
anyone coming into your place of harvest should be an, an extension of the growth of your harvest. It should not be to damage your harvest or cause you to be distracted, right? It's harvest time, y'all. We're about to pull it all in and let it rain down on us. I see you. Namaste.